Tell you what, I'm on the edge of my seat for this one. This is what MMA is all about. Yeah. James has got some excellent kicks, some great strikes. James, obviously, just trying to be aggressive, trying to be intimidating. Chris just laid back. He's been here before. He's seen guys like this. Boran finished his last fight with a triangle. And Chris Cape actually competed in the Tiger Muay Thai Never Tap Grappling Tournament in March this year in Thailand. Big right hand. But Cape finishes with the takedown and side control. Chris's jiu-jitsu is very on point, too. Nice trying to work that knee onto the belly, probably. Slide over. Good side control. There it is. Good side. And James Perrin has those long arms that might actually play against his favor. Little shot of Mark there, yelling out some instructions. Yeah, he's got some good fighters here, huh, Dr. And Joe? Absolutely, he got the mount. We missed how he did it, but I'm sure he slid that knee across the belly. Got full mount, very aggressive. James in some serious trouble right now, unless he can bridge. He tries to bridge, and oh! That's not good. Yeah, it's gonna cost him. Chris has got his back here, and there's still three minutes of this round, and they're both in the middle of the map. James has got himself in a very bad position against a skilled grappler like Chris Cape. He's got both hooks in, too, and they're in nice. Oh, he's easily sliding that left arm around the neck. Beautiful. Oh, nice James. strikes. James Reverse is just getting into another bad position. Not that much he can do, though, with Chris on top of him. You're not going to shake Chris, that's for sure. Oh, I spoke too soon. I spoke a little too soon. And that's why I didn't bet on it. But it looks like James wants to take this fight to his feet because I think he's had enough of Chris Cape's grappling already. Definitely dominating this first round. Cape. Yeah. Right. Chris is going for that leg, no doubt. James has got to be very careful in this position. Chris Cape oh, working that knee bar. Oh. James's leg is almost extended here. The fillets. Chris getting in the back. A couple hits to the side. Wow. And he doesn't seem concerned about I it. I know. I'll tell you what, my leg is hurting me just watching this. A lot of time left, too. A minute and 40 of the round. You know, James Height so important here, being able to strike him in the head. And James on top. He's got to keep those ankles out of the way. Yeah, he doesn't seem worried about anything he's going to do to him. James, very impressive. Now, Chris in a terrible position right here. James Moran working the quarter. Nelson. Chris trying to finish the single leg takedown. Cut into a double. 45 seconds left in the first round. Wow. Chris impressive again. Get in the back. One hook in. Nope. One hook in now. James is going to want to keep him up here against this cage because if they move away from the cage, he's really going to be in a bad position exposing his neck. Oh, oh there he goes. He's got the choke in. And there's 20 seconds in the round. Can he hang on? Oh, what a turnaround here. here. Chris trying to finish, but James hanging on strong. Only 10 seconds left in the round. Can James Moran yeah, hang on? Yeah. He's trying to wedge it in there. I don't think he's going to get it. 
Wow. And it's round two. I got my second round. That's what I wanted. At least two rounds. Yeah, that's right. single leg. He wants him on that ground. He's leaving his face open yeah. for a lot of damage. Taking a lot of punishment. That's at James's height. I mean, he can stand and punch the ground. It's going to be tough to get an inside trip like Cape is working for on a fighter that's six foot three, 170 pounds. Yeah, Chris definitely took a lot of punishment there. Chris wa wasting a lot of energy down there as well. And you can see the red marks on his body too. It's getting pounded in the ribs. Looks like James is working a guillotine. He's got it pretty tight. Very tight. He's got him up Very against the tight. cage. I think is he out? Is he out? Is he out? He out? He's out. He's out. He is out. Wow. Wow. Oh. James Boland, oh, the ex-CFL welterweight champion, 170 pounds with an impressive guillotine stoppage. There it is. Okay, guillotine yeah. ends with one arm. Yeah, he was out for a few seconds. Right? Right? Yeah. He's out. He, There's the arm. He's out. out. Right there. 